guys, happy Monday. I'm looking crazy because I already worked out, well not worked out, I went on a 30 minute walk with Ralph this morning and now I'm gonna get some breakfast made before I go teach my Zoom class. And this week, the cut really starts to get real because not only do I continue uh, like a lower calorie diet or meal plan that I was doing, but we are also adding four days of like 30 minutes of 20 minutes of cardio and then two days of 45 minutes of like a high interval craziness. So it's six days of added cardio um, to my like current workouts. So I'm gonna share everything with you guys, but I love it when we get to this point because it is more work, but it does start to really feel real and the body starts to shift immediately with all of the different things that are added. Uh, again, like I said the other day, mostly because I've already put in you know, a really decent amount of work that's been layered, so now everything really does come together because of everything else that's been done. So anyway, I'm super excited. I'm excited to share it all with you guys because now it's like go time. I'm so, so, so excited. So I'll be sharing with you guys everything that I do this week. I'll be sharing progress pictures and videos at the end of the week. Um, that's that. Happy Monday, guys. I'm losing myself, I'm losing myself, I'm losing, I'm losing myself tonight. Mr. Boot Camp is whipping up some amazing stir fry. He's so good at it. Um, I finished my workout and I went to run some errands. I went to drop some stuff off at Goodwill, return some stuff from Amazon and grocery shop. And now I'm back. Gonna have my third meal and then going to do my second workout and my posing. Shit is getting real. There's so much to do but getting it all done. It's a wrap, you guys. First of all, magical filter, new favorite filter of all time. So I did 30 minute walk this morning and then I did my full workout, it takes about an hour. Then I did 30 minutes of posing. And then I did, I wanna say it was 20 minutes of a high intensity circuit, which is supposed to be my cardio. It's all done. My water. We're getting there, we're getting there. I have some hours still. I've gotta fill my cup. Junior spilled one of my cups, so I have an extra cup aside from this gallon. All of my meals have been on track. I want to say I have three more to go. Well, two snacks and one meal. I'm feeling good. It's a productive Monday. Six weeks out. Every day is literally going to look like this for the next six weeks and then some. So that's it. And do not let it fool you. I still did a bunch of other things like run errands, go to the grocery store, like I said earlier, uh, deal with my child, obviously. Uh, do laundry <laughs> So it's not like I have the entire day to do this But when it gets closer to stage time It is more time consuming than it is at other times and it's just about making the time for it Like that's really what it is. I have a full afternoon of work. I have zoom at 6 at 7 and at 8 uh, And then after that is probably when I'll be able to shower and kind of do my thing uh, get some computer work done and then do it all over again tomorrow. So it's not about like, oh, I have all this time. This is all I do all day. That'd be lovely. Uh, it's about making the time. It's about prioritizing. Um, I don't have a choice in terms of like, I'm so close that this is, this is one of the priorities always, but especially at this point. So it's not about how much time I have. I still have a lot of work, a lot of home stuff and mom stuff that has to get done and that does get done. Um, and this just is, one of the other priorities so lots of priorities lots of different things but if i wake up at a decent time and i go to bed at a decent time because i also need rest <laughs> human um 
everything can get done. It's, it's about managing the time. It's about making the things that are priority a priority and getting it done. It's not about really having the time. So anyway, don't, no excuses. If you feel like you don't have the time, make the time, prioritize. Um, and that's that. Now I have to cook. I have 15 minutes to cook something before I go teach my Zoom. Hi guys, happy Tuesday. It's almost 7 p.m. and I have not been on here today. I've been swamped. I just finished teaching my Zoom, trying to finish this gallon of water. I am so tired today. Usually, I had a really great night of sleep last night actually and I was really rested, but then I usually like to do like my workout, my cardio, my walk, my posing, everything earlier on in the day and today that just did not happen. I, um, I've just been so caught up all day and I feel so tired and so drained, but I am five and a half weeks out. So that means that the work's gotta be put in no matter what. I have one more class to teach. I'll be done at eight and then right after that, I will go get my workout in. So it's just one of those days. Yesterday was like perfect timing. Today is not, but what are you gonna do, right? I'm losing myself, I'm losing, I'm losing myself tonight. Losing myself, I'm losing, I'm losing myself tonight. With your love, with your love, I'm losing myself. Hi guys, happy Wednesday. I'm putting on my shoes. I'm heading to the gym. So I have a facial today at 12.30. First of all, can we talk about this for a second? Two of my nails broke. So angry, it looks so weird. Um, I have a facial today at, I wanna say 12.30. So I gotta leave the house at 12. And um, after that, I cannot sweat till tomorrow. So I have to get my workout and my cardio done right now before I have to leave and then later I'll get my posing because I do sweat for that but it's not that much and if I do it inside in the AC it won't be so bad so I think it's leg day time to go do this let's go All right, you guys, dues are paid. I got my workout in. I'm doing the last three minutes of my cardio, which is a slow walk. I have to 
see my breakfast, take a shower, go to my facial, and later I will do my posing practice and all of my work for the day. Whew, freaking dying over here, but I'll tell you two things. One, I always work out in the silence. Does anybody else, if I'm working out by myself, Ralph likes to like listen to stuff or he puts on like really slow music, it's kind of weird. I like to work out in the silence, like there's not a sound on in the gym when I'm working out. The other thing is, this is the best way to start the day. I don't know why I get in my own way and leave it for the afternoon. Morning is where it's at. I'm gonna start doing it in the morning, let's see. Quanto? It looks so good though. Let me see it. Look at me again. <laughs> Look at me. <laughs> Ju, let's talk about your hair. You don't want to get a haircut? No. It looks so good. I just want my hair to be super long for a cool red mohawk. Cool red mohawk. <laughs> Hey guys, happy Thursday. Are you okay? Yeah. Coming to you live as a hot mess, but it's get shit done day. So tomorrow and Saturday, I have rented, we rented a, a suite, a hotel suite, uh, to do all of the posing sessions for all of the girls. I, I work with them all online, uh, but because the show is in Miami and a lot of them are in Miami, we decided to do some in-person posing. We did it a couple weeks back, uh, and we're gonna do it again tomorrow and Saturday. So I've been all day and will continue to do everything that I need to do to leave for a couple of days. So the first thing that I did this morning was go to Publix, and here I got some mac and cheese for Junior. I got some sauce. I got a bunch of microwavable Okay, this is easier. A bunch of microwavable rice. I got some microwavable pasta. I got some uh, plastic stuff. So what I'm doing now is cooking all the protein to go with this rice and this pasta. I'm gonna show you what I'm making. So this is some of the protein that I got just now. And there's some steak here that I'm gonna make for Ralph have some oil heating up here. I normally don't use oil, but I have oil in my meal plan, so I've been using a lot of it to cook. So what I'm making here, which was what I wanted to show you guys, is beef bulgogi. I think it's Korean, I don't know. I saw it, we saw it a few months back on someone's YouTube channel and we loved it. Uh, there's soy sauce in here and mirin. Uh, later, we're gonna add some sesame oil, so it does have some oils. But again, I substitute the oil that's supposed to be in my food for it. So this mixture of garlic, onions, there's some sugar in there, mirin and soy sauce. I'm gonna put two pounds of ground beef. I made enough for two pounds. And then I'm gonna put it here in the skillet. I'm gonna show you guys, and then I'm gonna give you the recipe because it's so delicious. It's, it's so easy too. All right, so you wanna mix this in. How magical is this bowl with the suction? So I can record. <laughs> and stir. Anyway, we're gonna mix this really, really well. Once it's all mixed in, I'm gonna put it in the pot. Here we go. Ah. Because I did two pounds, it's, it was a little hard to mix through, so I'll continue mixing in here. Basically, this is gonna stir fry in here for a while. I have it on medium high. I'm gonna go high for a little bit, and then I'll go back to medium low. 
All right, you guys, so I mixed it pretty well. Now I'm gonna let it be for a little bit and I'm going to cook the rest of my protein. Let me see what my child is up for. Tweezers? I can't pick up. <laughs> is this your project for today? Yes. This is the design we're gonna do. Let me see. Oh, wow, that's cool. Yes. Very cool. It kind of looks like Jack Skeleton. Mm-hmm. That is a very big pumpkin. Yes. I don't think I've ever seen one that big before. Me neither. <laughs> Are you excited? Mm -hmm. You're waiting for Sissy? Yeah, because she didn't know there was splinters. <laughs> There's also splinters on the outside of pineapple. Oh yeah? It's because it's very spiky. Yeah, you gotta be careful. Yeah, that's why I don't like touching the top. Well, you're gonna help her gut it, right? Yeah. I'll be back to see how it is when you're gutting it. All right, this smells so good right away. So it'll be kind of watery like that for a while, even though this is lean beef, but we did add some of that oil and, st and some of the soy sauce and stuff. So I'm just letting this cook on, I wanna say that's medium, whatever that is to you guys. And that's it, we'll wait it out. I'll keep showing you and I'm gonna post the recipe now. <laughs> Let's see. He grabbed it and he's like, oh. You gotta do it with your hands. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> it's, don't have to be sorry, you're outside. You can make a mess, you could hose it down later. Oh. <laughs> Ew. So look. Get in there, buddy. You gotta get your hands dirty. Oh. Hands? Wait, look, I'll what, show you. What's you, look, you gotta, like, he hates getting his hands dirty. Off, and then you grab it with your hands. Yeah, you scrape. Oh yeah! In here! In here! <laughs> <laughs> You're too funny. Scrape it with the spoon okay, and you. I'll scrape. And I'll grab you that. I'll scrape and you grab. Is that? <laughs> no, I'm gonna grab with you and I scrape some. Try and grab it now. You got it. You got to like get in there. Get in there. How is it? All right, guys, so my beef is done. Now I'm gonna do chopped green onions, sesame seeds, and sesame oil. You guys, how cute are these joggers? They're so comfortable with pockets. Best material ever. They're not tight. I love them. They're so cute. And such a change to regular leggings. Look at this blue. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's like mesh down here. Oh my God, I'm obsessed with these. I think these are my favorite. Let's see. Let's see the next one. Losing myself tonight. Losing myself, I'm losing. 
You guys, I want to show you the obnoxious process <laughs> that is literally leaving the house for one day. So we have Ralph's avocados between kids snacks and all the food that we have to eat. It's insane. There's junior stuff, rice cakes and almond butter, the pasta, the rice, this stuff. And that is not including, I'm going to show you all of the food prep that we're gonna take. All of these containers have to go. And we are literally leaving from today, Friday, coming back Saturday night. Literally like a little more than 24 hours. All right, you guys, we are getting stuff done. I woke up this morning, I read my 10 pages. We are going strong on 75 Heart here. And then I went on a walk. Then I worked out, took a shower, continued packing. Now I'm gonna have meal one and I have two minutes until I have to go teach my Zoom. So I gotta eat this food and get going. And then right after my Zoom, we are heading to our hotel for the weekend for all the posing. And that's that, lots of work on the road. You guys, I wanted to show you because I was looking at my other video. Look at all of these. So I did, not only did I do, look at that. This is with a filter. Not only did I do a facial the other day, but I did a crystal peeling. So it's like a mechanical, instead of it being an acid peel, it's a mechanical one where it's like a crystal pen. Well, the end of it is crystal and it kind of just breaks up your skin. I have, you can't tell with the filter, but I have a lot of sunspots on my forehead and on my nose. You can see some of the nose ones. And then I have some acne scars from years of acne a couple years back. And so I guess there were areas where it like really messed me up. Not messed me up, I mean the goal is for it to get better, but did, did, did the job, I hope. I can't wait to see in a few more sessions. You guys, there's Brie in my video. Creeper in the Creeper back. Creeper in the back. This chocolate rice cake, almond butter, vanilla almond butter, Justin's it has to be, the most magical ever. You have to try it. Thank me later. Hi guys, I am here with Monica. We are getting her posing going. Session one of this crazy weekend. Babe, you wanna say hi? <laughs> Loves my videos. Good. Yes. Tight. Let's go. Yes. Hello. <laughs> you knew I was going to be ready with the camera. <laughs> Okay, so 
There's a lot of different ways that you can do this. You should be able to- saw a video. Oh, great. Yes. So you should be able to do it standing, right? But the idea is for your belly button to come here. You want to put your belly button here. You want to come okay. here? So, oh my God. so the reason that I have people move over is because in this position, it's going to allow you to inhale deeper. Okay. So you're going to inhale por la nariz and draw your belly button all the way in. Y la aguantas ahí, and then you exhale as you hold it. Exhale, pero mantén el, el vacuum. Manténlo, 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 ahí. How? No. Uh, exactly. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's a nice exercise. So I tell everybody to do it in the shower because in the shower you're gonna, you're gonna hold it, no, hold it. Pero mantén. I don't know how to. No, no, pero está haciendo bien. Está. Inhale and this comes all the way in. Inhale. Now, poco a poco, pero mantén aquí. Ahí, good. There you go. Just like that. See, Marsha, the front, first front. Mm -hmm. Good. No, you go. Slow down. Go back. Look forward. One, two, three, four. Good. One, two, three. Four. No, I like it out. I like it. I like both. But whatever you pick, keep it for four. Okay. Then back. Relax the hand. One, two, three, four. Now turn to the side. Out the side. Open the hand. Bottom hand. Down top of the spine. Okay. One. Yes, good job. Abs tight. Good. Hold the bottom. Hold it. Focus on your breathing. Good. Closing here to try to face the front. What I do as a game plan is I like to put together four poses to each angle, okay? So we'll game plan four poses to the front, four to the side, four to the back, and these four to this side will be the same. So the side poses will be the same to both sides, just to different sides. Perfect, right. All there is. So what will change there is what you're doing with the arms. Okay. So if you want to walk forward and go up, you can. If you want to walk forward and do what you do in your very first pose, you just go here mm -hmm. and then do a hair thing. Mm -hmm. You can. Okay. okay. <laughs> you need four poses facing the front. So if this is the first one, mm -hmm. right? Then you can step back mm -hmm. and you can do, remember, you're still modeling. You don't have to flick here, but you can't just do, you can, you can do whatever you want. You can just stand there and do whatever, but then the girl that's next to you that's doing all these glamorous things is gonna stand out so much more, right? You know, so. Uh, turn that toe. So if that's the route you wanna go, now the only reason why I don't like that is because anytime hands are on the waist and facing the front, you're covering your abs, okay. right? So you're showing arms, but you're covering abs. Okay. And that's okay, right? But then if the first one is here, then we want to make sure that the next one is down so that you can see, like, it's not just about what you think looks good, it's like you're trying to showcase your body, right? So we have to make sure that we do that. All right, so from here, you can switch and bring the arms up, okay? And have that pose that you want, that's fine. Just make sure you don't, like, squeeze here. Exactly, all we're doing is, like, Pretending, mm -hmm. you know? It does look different, mm -hmm. right? So it starts to piece together. So it's it's not as simple as saying, like from the physique standpoint, like, oh, you know what? We're gonna add three sets of shoulder presses. Mm -hmm. Like it's not that, it's that all of the work compounds and now it's all starting to piece together. So as you practice your vacuum more and your posture improves, then I can see your shoulders more, right? And your routine is slow, so that slowness allows the body to accentuate. So it's all in the right place. This is when the October heavy first hits. We have a cool week calendar to really change the stuff and we're going to do a lot more wood and hamstring or like a lot more of the things that are going to sculpt the physique. Mm -hmm. Right. So. And that's the thing. Like that for some people might sit really like the shoulder and they're like, it's almost like they didn't eat. Right? But for you, if it makes you feel safe, you're like, great, I want to, 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 I want to
Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Remember, when you're walking to the side, shoulders back, abs tight, big okay. smile. Look at the judges. Sorry. Yeah. If you feel awkward leaving from here and you wanted to just step you back. You told me that last time. Oh, you are such a coach because you <laughs> No, no, because what it is, it's, it's a beautiful thing when you have to repeat yourself. <laughs> No, because you're consistent. Because when you see it's a good idea, you're like, you're, you're, you keep telling me the same thing. That's when you're doing the same thing. Yeah. Because you're here. Boom, boom, look. Step back. Walk away. Back. Back. Like that. Yeah, but with your toes turned out. You see how you put, yeah. So you see how it is like this here? You're picking it up, placing it the same way. Back. So, straight to this. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay. That works. Okay. Okay. So put the music. Let's do the whole thing. 